Joined by Hofstrad coach Shannon Smith, following our team's 14 to 10 defeat to Drexel in the CA semifinals. Coach, us your thoughts on the uh, game? Yeah, obviously a really tough game. Uh, hats off to, to Drexel, really. Congratulations to them and, and go, good luck to them on, on Sunday. Uh, but really proud of our team and our, and our players. Uh, we fought really hard in the fourth quarter to come back when we were down by five goals, I think it was, uh, to tie it up 10-10. I showed a lot of resiliency. Uh, I showed the heart of our team, the passion of our team. I'm just really super proud of them um, to fight back like that um, and, and to know them, to coach them is, is an honor. We love all of them and uh, just super proud of them. Yeah, you just mentioned the comeback down 10-5 in the third. Uh, Kerry Walzer scores right at the end of the third quarter, make it 10-6, and kind of just steamrolled you guys to tie in the game. Uh, uh, Katie Whalen tied the game at 10. What? What, what fueled that comeback and what allowed you guys to get back there to 10 Yeah, you know, I think just the trust, belief, and the heart that, that our team had in one another, taking it play by play. And, um, you know, it was everything that we kept talking about in huddles, play by play, possession by possession, um, and really believing in one another and, and playing with heart out there. And, and our players did. They left it all out there on the field and just extremely proud of them. Yeah, the last 20 minutes seems like the 50-50 balls were all Hofstra's way and you guys were really feeding off, almost off, off what was happening on the field. Did you kind of feel that way too? Yeah, we had all the momentum at that point. Um, and it was incredible to see. Uh, there was, a, like I said, a lot of fight and um, you know a lot of characteristics that you can't teach you know those are the intangibles that you can't teach and our players and our seniors are going to take that with them and it's going to what's make them super successful in life a real back and forth first half you guys had your opportunities they had their opportunities what did you see in the first half the uh, the led into the yeah, you know, um, we were coming up with some D stops offensively. We were, you know, staying with them, putting it away, um, and they went on, on a little bit of a run with us. But again, we stuck with them, which was super impressive to see. And uh, it's been an incredible two week stretch for Taylor Manella. What has fueled this nine points last week, five goals today, and she kind of just carried you guys for the first maybe like 40 minutes today yeah she's playing really well uh it was really exciting to see and we're excited to you know have her come back next year and and continue this momentum that she had at the end of the season uh, it was really impressive to see and then uh, some seniors obviously played really well tonight you had amanda guerra with a couple goals what'd you see from them tonight yeah, you know, the senior class, there's a lot of them, right? We have three um, fifth-year seniors and, and eight seniors, so 11 of them. And I thought that they played their butts off um, and they really carried our team. And, you know, we talked about in the locker room, just super proud, you know, and, and be happy to get to, to know each other. And, and you always have lifelong friends and, and sisters sitting in this locker room. Um, and it's not been an easy way with, with college athletes, right, these past two years with COVID. And, um, you know, so just really impressive and how they were able to handle their curveballs in life. and. Um, to be resilient um, and to see them come out on the other side is, is pretty amazing. Yeah, another nine win se season this year following, following last year's NCAA tournament appearance. Just your overall thoughts on the program and your senior class you've already kind of touched on. Yeah, you know, just super proud. Um, and our program is, is going in the right direction and, and having back-to-back -back successful years. And that's a testament to our players on our team, the hard work they put in, our leadership that we have. And, um, you know, it will be fun to kind of sit back and um, – evaluate our season and be super proud of our team and the accomplishments that they made um, and proud of our seniors and, um, you know, take some time off and, and get back into it next year. Thank you, Coach.